Yeah. I'm afraid you're grave digging your stomach. Exhuming Matsumine curry into toilet stews and using your gay reflex as a shovel. A sop against the cemetery. I got the sense that every watery eye is from crying. Running faucets disguised in the grave. Robbery of the inside. Don't want to be undertaken. Tell you it's okay to bury your face. I'll help carry the way the complexes play. Paul Bearer at dining room funerals as you consume those 15 pounds you want to lose weight. Heavy on your self conscious. I tell you you're beautiful even when my eyes are closed. I want strangers to quit saying you're pretty, then maybe you let that so-called flap under your arm rest in peace. Rather than resuscitate what it means to be comfortable in your own skin. I hope the funeral procession of cat calls doesn't call back bathroom stall visits to fix your self-image. Because you're all beautiful even when my eyes are closed. Oh. Let the catacombs of uncombed hair not be bone straight. Let the strands reflect the skeletons of African ancestors. And if it happens that your hair falls straight naturally, I'll still love the texture. I don't mean to be crypt keep Robertin. Signs are still cryptic when blood leaks from blisters in the roof of your mouth. Pretend team don't sting with its acidic mixture of citrus, but when the truth comes out. I'll kiss cheeks and listen, and if the mortician puts on too much blush and eyeliner, I'll remind myself we are both two suicide jumpers playing hopscotch with the skyline. I know your wings are made for you to be fly. I'm just worried this is another rendition of ignorance. I'll shoot the sun, so the splatter of UV rays blind those eyes that ever gazed upon you. I dress the day in black for the funeral, make the sunrise whittle to all things beautiful, let the eulogy read, I accept you, even when my eyes are closed. Open casket of a heart, rest here on March grave, but the epitaph will say, I love you, even when my eyes are closed. Thank you.